I don't want to be on camera, so I'm asking you to take it off. By law, okay. if I'm asking you to take me off camera, you yep. have to. I will. So take then me do off it now. now. Okay. No, I can I can film this. No, I just can't, can't post it. No, stop. That's a big car. Okay, well, and we meet again. So um, let's start by explaining to you the day's events, okay? Uh, it's a beautiful Friday, and the weather's amazing. We have uh, a lot of cars going in and out, completely sold out today, which is a normal thing, all right? It's, a, it's Friday, we, we do good on the weekends because people wanna go out from California, send to Vegas, and, and have fun. So let's show you right here. This here is the smallest part of the damage, and I cannot believe that this actually hit right here. But uh, a really cool guy, and uh, he came by, he wanted to take the car for the day, they took the car out for the day, and they went to Red Rock. And on the way back from Red Rock, they were faced with a little bit of adversity. Now, this is actually another one of my firsts. I have yet to have this happen, but uh, they were driving behind a um, somewhat of a truck, and it started to drop stuff out of it. And you can now see uh, we've got, uh, what was an Ikea sign. So the good news in here is that um, the top was down and no one got hit, no one got hurt. And you saw the tail light back there, that's crazy, right? Like stuff comes out, cracks the windshield, look at the light, okay? Destroys the light, you have dents and dings all over the place. Now, uh, this is all clear bra and paint damage there. And uh, over here, it's crazy where this hit, but hit the uh, the washer directly on it. Um, and then down there, there's a bunch of damage on the bottom because the rocks went underneath. So, you know, the major damage was taking the brunt of the glass. But what happens now is um, the woman who was driving the truck was found at fault. But, uh, you know, the car was involved in a incident, not like accident. The police came. Now, um, we have an accident report and uh, that lady was at fault. So we're gonna go, we're gonna replace the windshield. Three weeks out of Italy, I've already called. And so for three weeks, this car will sit here and make zero money. Now this car rents for $1,500 a day. So hopefully the woman has good insurance because um, you know, we don't know, I haven't filed a claim on her policy yet. We're gonna get to the office and do that next. But you know, we need to definitely get the loss of use because this right here is an extremely, extremely, extremely expensive problem because we only have one 488 Spider, Just like the Black Huracan, you know, it's a real problem. Now today, uh, I actually purchased a new car because the White Huracan's damage from, I don't know, three days ago, that the, the, uh, the one they went into the fence, yeah, I mean, it, it just sucks because, you know, we, we can't be without a Huracan Spider. So I bought a brand new one from Newport Beach and it's coming right now. It's uh, it's very beautiful. So Mario, in uh, to this today's vlog, you can extend that and uh, show them the new car that's coming tomorrow. Get your camera out my face. Get your camera out my face. Get your camera out my face. Walk out the camera. Get your camera out my face. Walk out of the camera. Hey man, turn your camera off. Get your hey. Cool. I'll have him jack it up so it's easier to see.
So the reason why this is not this is a problem is because as a shipping company, you don't you can't damage the bottom of the bumper. Okay. Okay. So look at this. Right? So it's Just very go simple. Ahead and do what you Bye, need to do, and I'll you know. I mean, are you guys declining that you did that? Hey, what I'm this saying is how is, the dealer gave it to you. Is, you know. Is, look at the carriage of every car you I'm have. Saying, That's gonna happen when you drive on the street. So it's okay it's for the shipper happen. to do it. What I'm saying. It's what two I'm saying inches is off the right ground. Here. What I'm saying is this. At first, look, man. Yeah. I'm asking you. To, I don't want to be on camera, so I'm asking you to take it off. By law, okay. if I'm asking you to take me off camera, you yeah, have to. I will. So take then me do off it now. now. Okay. No, I can. I can film this. I just can't post it. No, stop. I want it right me now. Email. Give me the email. I need the bill of lading. Give me the email. It's really simple. Give me your email. I'll email it to you right now. Write it right now. Hey man, I'm just give it, we didn't have too many issues. So Listen, me, it's if you say if you're not going to give me the bill of lading, give me your email. Houston at Royalty Exotic Cars, but I want a paper copy. No, I don't have a paper copy. I do everything electronic. Okay, well, can what's, I sign it? You will be able to sign it. You can sign it electronically. Okay, great. Well, I'm not going to sign it because there's damage on the car. So well, I need you well, to give me the I bill later. You if you're not signing it, then I'm not. I'm not. Um, I want to sign off that there's damage. All right, man. You can sign off on it. What's your name, Houston? H O U S T O N, C R O S T A, or what actually, that's my name. Do you need my email? Okay, so just signature. Well, I need to, you know, we have I'm to. I'm sending it to you, dude. I know, this is an I'm inspection. Signing. I'm sending it but to you. But I don't know it's what I'm signing. This is your BOL, it said BOL. I, can I, I need to mark the damage on the BOL. I need, I, I really need a paper here. copy. I put it on here. Okay. It's on there, that's why I was recording it. You got the whole thing, so. Can we see it? Man, I'm just sign the thing or I'm, I'm leaving. I, I want to see what I'm signing. Okay. It's very simple. I just, I just told you. You asked for the BOL, I'm sending it. I know, but I, I'm not going to sign off on the BOL if there's no damage reported on All the right, thing. I, I, look, bro, I'm done with this. I, and that's okay. If you wanted, if you just say you don't want to give me the BOL, it's fine. That's not what I'm saying. I'm trying to give it to you. But I, it doesn't show you me. Just, it's just sign. a signature box. You would not sign. There's nothing on there. What's it's just a email? signature box. What's your email? Houston, H O U S T O N, at royaltyexoticcars.com. Houston at Royalty Exotic Cars dot com. You should have that on your phone. All right, so if you guys are All right, after an incident like this, it's always really good to uh, document it. And uh, you never know what's gonna happen, right? Um, I, I chose not to pursue any criminal charges because in the heat of the moment, right, a mistake like that can cost someone, you know, their business and uh, a lot of stuff in the long run. And I, I, I kind of like, I, I don't wanna say I feel for people, but at the same time, I don't want a, a civil problem, right? Where like it's just a scratch on a bumper and it's a five thousand dollar repair to cost someone their entire company. So um, I, I'm going to give the the shipping company an opportunity to utilize the insurance to repair the vehicle uh, and uh, you know apologize for kind of like attacking me. And uh, we're going to go from there. But uh, it's always good to document it. And you know we filed a um, what's called a red car. So it's not like charges it's just kind of like a report so that we can kind of document what happened and uh, to make sure that if anything comes back and you know someone comes back and wants to do some crazy damage or something in the future that this is on record that it happened